Here we are, August the 23rd, uh, 2022. First morning of harvest. We're harvesting 115 for Papa Petro Perry Winery this morning. The fruit looks beautiful, tastes good. I've been tasting all morning. Our wonderful crew is working behind us. Uh, my son and grandson are here working, and this is a Laris family, and that's what we're doing, working as a Laris family for Papa Petro Perry Wines. Hello, I'm Nick Laris, and uh, you're sitting in the uh, Laris Family Vineyards. We're sitting in the middle of our 777 block, which uh, goes into 777 uh, uh, Papa Petro Perry, and also in the Laris Family, and part in the Russian River. Uh, this vineyard that we're sitting, this block of vineyard we're sitting in, was planted in uh, 1990. And uh, it's, it's on a, a little different trellis system. It's what I call the Laris trellis. The, the, all our brush is tucked in between and we don't pull very many, very many leaves. And I'll let Todd tell you a little bit about harvest. He's one of the hard workers that uh, helped relieve me so, so that I don't have to walk up and down these hills as often and, and him and, and his son and our grandchildren come out and, and uh, do this, he'll tell you. Harvest is really the most exciting time of the year. Uh, coming out here really early in the morning, often it's foggy, uh, it'll still be dark. We'll have a crew out here and we'll be running the tractors to make sure that the crew always has the bins they need that are empty and that we're bringing the full bins back and forth. It's a lot of hard work, but it's also just a tremendous amount of fun. And especially as dad said, the way we do this is it's a family operation. My sister's son, uh, Jojo, comes out here and he helps drive the tractors and uh, can't even begin to explain how much we look forward to it, even though it's a lot of hard work. Blair's family um, vineyards uh, has, uh, we're located right in the heart of Russian River. Uh, this ranch here, uh, Lara's family, where Papa Petro Perry gets his uh, grapes. The, the grapes mature early compared to most others, and and we've been really fortunate. Uh, we usually have a harvest in and in barrels and aging before it. We've ever had any kind of smoke issue here, and uh, our soils are uh, ideal Russian River. There's uh, uh, what we call pioneer soil, which is a fine white soil. There's gravel spots in here. There's sandy spots in here. And uh, it's just ideal for growing grapes. We have that morning fog that comes in just about every morning and keeps the grapes cool. And, and our evenings drop down into the 50s. So, so we have the ideal spot to grow grapes for Pinot Noir. It couldn't be any better. And uh, uh, as far as sustainability, we're 100% sustainable, certified. We we have a, a creek that runs through the front of us that that we wildlife can move from one ranch to another without coming through the vineyards. Uh, there's birds, there's quail down there, there's duck down there, swans once in a while. It, it is just an ideal place and, and it's so ideal for Russian River. My mother named this place Godzilla Lakers uh, 70 years ago and the sign still hangs in front even though it's Lara's family. Uh, the ranch is Godzilla Lakers and I believe it is Godzilla Lakers. <laughs> 